Hello everyone. I hope all of you are doing well. The results for the gate 22 are out and we have with us a very special guest to discuss what exactly to do when it comes to the gate, how exactly to prepare and sort of do very well at the test, right? So uh, we have Biplab with us. Uh, Biplab has kindly agreed to join us and share some insights on the test. Uh, so uh, uh, hello Biplab, thank you for joining us. Uh, thank you, thank you. I, yeah, at the onset, we'd just like to know a bit about yourself. What is it that you're doing right now? What has been your journey like till now? And then we'll move on to your gate preparation. Yes. So, um, I, I am Biplab Rai. I'm, I'm from Kolkata. Now, currently, I am doing my bachelor's degree from Guru Nanak Institute of Technology in the CSE background. So, um, starting from my first year, when I entered into my college, my primary aim was to get a good job, to get a grab a good job. So uh, from my first year itself, I started preparing for coding and machine learning and right, developing all these jobs, many things. But then uh, somewhere I realized that um, GET is a good option to get that, get, go, get there. It is an easy option, easier option to get there going from IITs. And at that time, uh, surprisingly, I got a scholarship in my third semester. I did class, I was class topper and from there I got a scholarship 100 percent scholarship from the gate academy it's ims gate academy now uh and from that scholarship i i was really that pleased that from that i got that scholarship and from there now i i started my gate journey and throughout that one and a half years uh first when i got that uh, scholarship in the end of second year then uh in my third year i i appeared for get once at that time, I had completed my 60% of my subjects mm. and I wasn't sure about my result. What I just I just uh, thought that, OK, let's see for the exam. Let's see what happens. And mm. uh, that with that 60% of subjects, I, I got a rank of 1,600 around. And mm. that gives me that confidence that uh, if with only 60% subject, if I can do that, then with 100% subject, I can do a good rank. And also, I at that time, I haven't uh, covered any test series or such type of things. So mm. I, I gained confidence from that. It was really important for me to, for that confidence was really helping me a lot throughout my journey. And after that, uh, I again started preparing all, I ended all subjects within like, june july and last six seven months i just go for previous year question test series all this mm. and that's all okay uh so biplab didn't mention his rank but biplab is rank 61 this year right yes yeah, yeah so uh you, biplab you mentioned a very interesting thing uh, you mentioned that gate is an easy test right but a yeah. lot of people might not agree with you they might feel that gate is a very difficult test right so uh, people have this thing that toppers feel that gate is an easy test but I'm sure that you would have also faced some difficulties uh, going ahead in terms of some subjects or some part of the test that you might want to improve. So for all those people who feel that GATE is a difficult test, uh, what would be, what would be your thoughts? At the first time when I, I was thinking about GATE, uh, I personally is not good at theory. Okay, mm. I, I, I especially good at numerical coding, these type of things. Then I thought this is theoretical things. It's not for me. So, but when I started preparing that, then mm. I understood it's not only about theory, it's conceptual things. It's all about understanding those topics. So it it's, uh, looks easy when you started preparing, you started understanding those topics from insights. Yes, it looks easy when you start those topics actually. Okay. Uh, and any preparation plan that you followed? So, uh, so many hours of preparation you had to do every day. Was there any schedule? Yeah, uh, that lockdown helped me a lot. I got mm. much more time in home to prepare for gate. Mm. And yes, uh, not any fixed time. Um, yes, I did study for a part day. I got I got uh, six to eight hours per day. Uh, Yes, and uh, my main strategy was I have to revise that revise and revise. Mm. So I have revised as many times as I can. That's it. Okay. Uh, and what about the IMS Gate Academy a test series, which which you 
uh, yes. sort of started taking in your uh, second attempt in the final year. So second how, how did that go? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that that's what that was very good. I was getting good ranks within 10, 20. And mm. it also gives me uh, very confidence that yeah, I can do better in gate. So it really helped me. Okay, okay. Uh nice people, nice to nice to hear that. Uh so going ahead, any message for the aspirants who will be taking it in 23 or 24? Anything you want to share? It's just uh, be consistent. That is a very important thing, being consistent hmm. um, in GET. And best of luck. That's all. <laughs> okay. Okay. And you mentioned that lockdown helped you, right? Uh, and then you could yeah. prepare for longer yes. because you were at home, right? So now that the situation is changing, right? Now people will have to go to college and balance their GATE preparation. So yes. anything that you would have done differently? Uh, in that case, uh, managing some timetable is very important. I, I really do that. Even mm. if I don't have college, still I do that. I manage my subject-wise timetable always that I will, I will read this subject from this time, 9 to 12. So I, I have I still have those routines managed that uh, from this day, from that to that. That timetable is very important. So, mm. yes, that everyone should do. Okay. Okay, blah, blah, blah. That, that is great advice. I mean, you have to have consistency, right? I mean, once you decide yeah. that you want to do something, you have to have a plan. And I'm sure there will be a lot of surprises along the way. There will yes. be a lot of times wherein you will feel demotivated. So in your case, yes. uh, the good thing that happened was you fared well in your first attempt, right? That gave yeah. you a lot of confidence, right? Confidence. Uh, but uh, I'm sure there would have been some challenges during the preparation phase and during the actual test as well. So Biplab, how was your actual test day like? I mean, what did you feel when you were taking the test? Yes, I, I was really not that much confident because when I started my test, first uh, some questions were not so much like I, I, I didn't perform well in first some questions. So mm. I was a little bit tense and is low on confidence. So along with it's just going, going and it's done. And when I uh, like go home, I try to calculate how much marks I can I could get that I saw it's around 60 to 64, 64, around 60. To, so at that time, I thought Jim, it will not give me that under 100 rank. But mm. also, I had plan in my I had in my mind that question wasn't that much also easy, like 2021, mm. what I have appeared for. So I don't I didn't know that what is what will be my result. But yeah, that's a, I got okay. that. Okay. Yeah. So people are again. It makes sense. I mean, obviously, uh, during the test, one thing you have to do is you have to back yourself. From what you said, I under my yes. understanding is you have to back yourself, right? So if you have already shown that you can get a good rank without preparation, and you have prepared harder in the next year, if you are not able to solve a question, you know that most of the other people will also not be able to solve that question. Yes. yes, yes. Right. So that is what that will help confidence. you move on. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Otherwise, people tend to take it on their ego and get stuck in one or two questions and then that um, uh, sort of destroys the entire test right so that should not happen no. so 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 very well said biplab very 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 well said uh, so biplab again uh, I, I would like to thank you for taking out the time to talk to all our viewers uh, it, it's really nice listening to people who have done well at an actual test and the kind of hard work that i have put in throughout the journey so I'm sure that people will get motivated uh, listening to your advice and I'm sure people will form timetables, will will sort of react to surprises in a better manner, be consistent with their preparation, uh, get the uh, hang of the test before they go for the actual test. So all those things are, are like really good takeaways developed. So thank you so much for taking out the time. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so thank you, Biplab. And uh, for all the viewers out there, uh, please stay tuned. We will have more such activities and events coming up for you. Uh, to help you throughout your gate preparation so all the best to all of you who are also watching the video and all the best to bipl up for your for your journey ahead for your career ahead i'm sure you are going to do an amazing job if you keep up with the the work ethic that you have maintained till now right so thank you bipl up once again